what's good with y'all man say bro this is the video of me completing uh the Sami Zayn live event or the uh drew mcintyre whichever one you want to say bro um the crazy thing is as you can see this is just a recording of me playing it i ain't got no audio i wasn't talking none of that i wasn't really expecting to beat it <laughs> on the first try bro well not the first try as y'all already know uh, i had uploaded a video i tried it twice and i got dropped off twice by sammy uh, so this would be my third time but this would be my first time back on to try it again i was going to test it out to see how to go backstage and then see how was the match once i get backstage um and then voila what you're about to see <laughs> for the ones that did not know because i didn't know you are able to go backstage the whole time. I didn't even know you was able to go backstage the whole time. You feel me? Uh, but as you can see, man, we made it backstage. So we made it backstage, man, I went straight to doing my thing. Now, one thing that I just found out is, as y'all know, um, I keep doing a Urinagi uh, slam. That's the slam that I just did on him on the first uh, the first move. I did my tunt. I got the first tunt out the way. I'm going to drop him with the Urinagi again. Bow. Go ahead and push up on the D-pad for the wake up tunt. Then I'm gonna do go ahead and do the second tunt to go and get 30 mile faction points out the way. But um, I got on here to test the test it out to see what I'm able to get away with. And one thing that I realized is if I if he reverses me, for some reason, if you spam circle, you'll be able to grab him before he do anything else to you. So you don't even have to dodge at all. I didn't realize it until like I'm doing it at the beginning. Did I realize it at the beginning? I think I had spammed it and I seen it. And then I just kept doing it. I don't know. I don't remember. You feel me? I'm not even going to lie. Uh, but as you can see, his his body is already yellow. We got 30 of my faction points. We are we getting our grabs, our grab attacks going. We're getting our heavy attacks going. And we are working on his body at the same time. As you can see, man, I ain't dodged not one time. Not one time. I ain't dodged, bro. Um, I'm starting to like that Urinagi slam. I'm not gonna lie to you. I don't know how many more people have that slam. This right here, the Urinagi. But um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Th this is a W slam. You feel me? Because I don't even have to dodge. By the time he get back to me, now I don't know if it's just this live event. I don't know if it's just Sammy. His move sets are just slow. Um, but going up against Sammy Zayn, bro, you have enough time to grab him right after he reverses you. Uh, to go ahead and go for the Urinagi again, or you can just go for whatever. Look, he he reverse it. I grab him before he even grabbed me. Now it could be that we are backstage and it's slowing him down for some reason. He's not as aggressive like a lot of people said backstage. So if you having a hard time with doing this, I will advise you to go backstage. You feel me? Um, because it's way more easier <laughs> to do. Uh, I know a lot of people say they was having a hard time even getting out the ring. I don't know. I ain't really had no hard time getting out the ring. So. Uh, I'm not gonna lie on that part. As you can see, I might my my body is getting damaged because he reverses me, but at the same time, he still don't even have enough time to even do nothing to me. Um, this is when I start. Every time he try to get up, I'm punching him because I know he got sting like a bee, and I'm trying to get him stunned. As soon as I get him stunned, I'm gonna try to go ahead and um, work on. Well, I was supposed to work on hitting him with the. Superman punch. I don't know why I didn't do it at the beginning. I don't know why it took me so long to do that. But hitting with the Superman punch, I'm trying to store up my my uh finishers at this moment. You see his his uh his health is on green. I don't know why I couldn't even think of health. Um well I got on red now. So I'm trying to get it as low as I can at this moment. Because if I pin him too early, it's not gonna prop his uh resiliency, even though resiliency is not uh active at this moment because if it was active it would be uh lit up but if i if i pin him too early he's not gonna pop his resiliency plus he get all his health back right after he jump out of the pen you feel me so i'm trying to make sure that once i do my move on him or once i go for a pin his health is low enough to pop his resiliency so once i go back and do it again you know what I'm saying? I'm straight. Now, I don't know if this is true, but I've been looking and I've seen that people have been, once they pop his resiliency, they go they go for an instant pin. I don't know if that's pop, if there's like every character just like that. Once you pop their resiliency, you, you are now able to just instantly, um, you know what I'm saying? Go for a pin or or whatever. I'm, so I'm about to test that out because I've seen a lot of people, as soon as they pop it, 
they'll knock them back down and they just pin them right after. You feel me? Uh, I don't know why right now I'm not trying to focus on stunning him. I should have went for the stun. I guess I'm trying to get another sig, a signature. I don't know. I think I'm trying to grab another signature at least. Uh, and then I go for my finisher and all this stuff. So I guess that's why I'm constantly still just use, using the Urinagi at this moment. But I'm walking through everything. Y'all see everything that I'm doing, bro. He reverses. He don't even got enough time to even grab me. I'm already going for another Urinagi before he even put his arms up to do anything to me. Now, we almost got his stun bar going. Um, but you know, we're trying to do the wake up time and all this stuff. It takes a little time to get it gives him time to you know saying recover but we ain't really worrying about that right now i think once i get my other finisher or once i get my my sig i probably would go for yeah that's what i'm trying to get to i don't know what i'm doing right now to tell you the truth <laughs> i really don't know what i was doing you feel me because i probably would have already had did my finisher already i could have had worked on getting his uh signature and his finisher later you feel me i don't know why i made this way more harder than it has to be you feel me unless i'm just trying to get his health as low as i can i, I don't know what's the situation or what the reason or what i was thinking when i was doing this because right now i feel like i'm making this longer than i have to but at the same time it's better to be you know what i'm saying to be patient than to move too fast and then everything goes wrong so and then that's when everything went wrong everything went wrong but i ain't no jumping out <laughs> the jumped out saved me you feel me but uh if i would have stayed and doing uh stayed doing what i was supposed to i would not even have these uh had a hard time um i should have when he was getting up i think i can't even time to okay can, are you gonna time it bro okay yeah i'm struggling right now finally one more hit it would have been over try to go for um the superman punch but for some reason yeah <laughs> it popped that finisher i mean that sig right there but anywho spear yep spear look at his health his health is gone it's pretty much gone now i can go ahead and go for the pin pop his resiliency now i know the next time i do something he is out of here it's a wrap you feel me uh like i said i did make this a little bit harder what you want to do is if you want to do anything you kind of want to like once he start to get up try to hit him then he's going to either roll or reverse it then you go for the urinagi again but you know what i'm saying it is what it is i went on and went for the stunt of uh, the stumps soon as he rolled out or reversed it instantly went for the finisher again which i'm probably going to do it again probably i don't know or maybe i'm just going to try to play it smart i don't even remember what i did in this match i'm not even going to lie to you yeah, I'm trying to go for it again. Trying to get the stun off. Bop, got the stun. Picked him up. Go for another one. Yeah. Sometimes this game was acting crazy too. You hear me? But one, two, should be over. Three. Game time. I did make this a lot harder than what it's supposed to be. <laughs> I'm not going to lie to you. Uh, but this is when i completed it and this is when i beat it as you can see right now man we end up completing it and stuff like that y'all let me know what y'all think about everything bro i will try to clean up what i did wrong and try to see if i can find a faster way this this right here took around eight minutes to complete but i hope y'all enjoyed the video if y'all did hit that like button subscribe all the other good stuff i get it y'all the next one i'm out you